Hello and welcome back to another episode of Culture Dudes and today we're at Painters Hall. The Hall is home to the worshipful company of painters and stainers and the building lies between Huggin Hill and Little Trinity Lane in the City of London. The origins of the company can be traced back to the 13th century and they rank 28th in seniority of the city livery companies. The first hall was donated by an alderman by the name of Sir John Brown to King Henry VIII in 1532. It was later destroyed in the Great Fire in 1666 and again by enemy action in 1941. In the little side room next to the stairs, you will see a plaque with former masters and painters that have served as Lord Mayor. Just outside is a marble bust dedicated to Thomas Evans, who served as warden in 1664 and master during the Great Fire of 1666. Hayter's Hall has many beautiful stained glass windows. We spotted this one. The monarch's motto can be seen here. It's in French and it says Dieu mon droit, which means God and my right. In the courtroom, there is a wide selection of historical portraits belonging to people and notable events of the times past. The motto of the company can be seen here in the coat of arms. It says, Amor quiet obedientium, which means love can compel obedience. We now enter the banqueting hall. It is very impressive. There is a fine collection of royal portraits dating back from the 17th century till today's royal family including quite a fetching one of the new King of England, Charles III, in his Royal Air Force uniform and robes of the garter. The north window features the coat of arms of the 12 Lord Mayors of the City of London who are liverymen of the Painters' Company and the company's coat of arms. The room also has very exquisite looking crystal chandeliers that really light up the room. The west window features coats of arms belonging to the Prince of Wales, the City of London Corporation and Her Majesty the late Queen Elizabeth II. The Painter Stainers Company is the fifth oldest out of the 110 livery companies in the City of London. It was given its royal charter in 1581 by Queen Elizabeth I. There have been many alumni over the years, in fact, over the centuries, and some notable, others not so much. The one that stood out is a name British people of a certain age will be familiar with, and that is Dennis Thatcher. Dennis Thatcher was, of course, the husband of the former Prime Minister of Britain, Margaret Thatcher. The Painted Chamber is the last room on a tour. The room feels very intimate and is full of exquisite paintings with dark contrasts. This is a really lovely location and if you're looking to host a dinner party, why not do it here? We'll stick a link in the description below with details of whom to contact. We do hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you very much for watching. Please help us by liking, sharing and commenting below. We would love to hear your thoughts and ideas for future projects. And uh, we'll see you on the next video. This has been Michele and Paz. Till next time.